What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you what are monohydric alcohols. Monohydric alcohols are those organic compounds that have only one hydroxyl group. We have only one alcohol functional group. So what are the simplest monohydric alcohols? The simplest one is going to be the simplest alcohol as well, which is going to be CH4O or we can say CH3OH both of them are correct and we call it methanol methanol or sometimes called wood alcohol another example would be C2H5OH which we call it ethanol or alcohol simply call it alcohol another one is going to be c3 h7 oh it can be propan 2 o or propan 1 o is going to be another format or another isomer propan 2 o which we know it as isopropyl alcohol or sometimes called rubbing alcohol what's next next can be butanol c4h9oh so butanol or buton one all or sometimes called butyl alcohol another example is pentanol c 5 h 11 oh so we have pentanol sometimes called amyl alcohol as you see here the general formula for this group is cn h 2 n plus 2 o so we have one oh group so we have one oxygen and number of hydrogen is two times number of carbon plus two. So that's going to be the general format of monohydric alcohol. So again, mono, when we are talking about monohydric alcohol, it means that we are talking about those organic compounds, those alcohols that have only one hydroxy group. We can classify monohydric alcohols to primary alcohol secondary alcohol and tertiary alcohol what's the difference whenever we are dealing with primary alcohol it means that the hydroxy group is connected to only one carbon so we have OH here and we have the rest of the branch in this format so the OH group is connecting to one carbon and this carbon is connecting to just one carbon here what about the secondary alcohol in secondary alcohol this hydroxy group is connecting to the carbon and this carbon is connecting to two other carbons so since we have two carbons here we call it secondary alcohol for example in this case we have two propanol and next one we have tertiary alcohol tertiary alcohol the alcohol group is connecting to the carbon which this carbon is connecting to three other carbon atoms so this carbon is connecting to three other carbon atoms so that's why we call it tertiary alcohol so monohydric alcohol can be primary can be secondary and can be tertiary because in all these examples we have only one hydroxyl group i hope you enjoyed this video please leave me a comment if you have any question and i get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching and have a great day